Once you import your photo and video into Adobe Lightroom, so you can take care of them. In here, this is the watch space in Lightroom. Lightroom has four big panels on each side, one on the top, one on the bottom, one on the left, one on the right in here. On the top in here, this is the panel for the modules. This is the feature that you select from here. On the bottom here, this is the film strip. These are the photo that you're working on. The left and the right panel, this is the function panel. This panel depends on the module that you select from here. The first one in here, the library module. This is the location that you organize your photo. For example, in here, you can view your photo. You can select your photo, compare your photo. You can also delete your photo and group your photo all in here. The develop module in here, this is the location that you manipulate your photo. For example, you can crop your photo in here. You can do some exposure adjustment for your photo. And noise reduction, sharpening for your photo. Many things that you can do apply on your photo so you can do it in here. The map module in here. In here, it shows you the location that your photo has been taken. So you can take in here. This is the location for this photo. And Book module in here, in here you can decide your photo book, then you can print it, print it online or you can print it on your computer. And here, slideshow in here. Slideshow, you can decide your photo slideshow, so for your photo presentation. You can present your photo on your screen in here or on another screen if they are connected, so you can select from here. And the print module in here. This module, so you can decide your photo print uh, for a single photo or multiple photo at once, so you can decide here and print it on your computer in here. And the web module in here. This is the location that you decide your photo web gallery and then you can upload to your website so you can share the photo with your friend online. That will be easy in here. And the last one in here, this is the synchronize button. This is the synchronize the photo over the cloud on your plan, so you can use the Adobe Lightroom Classic to take care of your photo on the cloud in here. And in here, the four panel can be open and closed in here, so you can click in here, open then, close then in here. And right click in here, they have the option, so in here, auto hide and show, or auto hide only, or manual in here. So let me show you in here what that means in here when we first close it. And I move my cursor up in here. It will automatically show the panel in here. And when I move my cursor out, it will automatically hide the panel. This is the option in here. Auto hide, that means auto hide only, but they don't auto show in here. Manual, that means they, you have to click to open, click to close it in here. And in here, sync with the upper side panel in here. If you click this option and upper side, the top, button left and the right in here. So let's take a look. You click here, open together the top panel and the button panel in here at once and we close it together. In here I don't do this because I need to open the film strip most of the time and the modules panel I mostly I don't need to open it so I can have more space working on my screen in here. So I can accept this by shortcut on my keyboard in here. And for this, so we can do for the left and the right panel, same thing, we can open and close it on here, like this, in this. And we can right click, this is the option, that's the same as the, for the top and button panel in here. In here, for Lylum, we have the module that we select. Each of the module, the left and the right panel can be different, yeah, like this. The panel inside here, we have the panels inside. We have catalog, folder, collection, publish in here. And we can open and close it by clicking on here like this. And for the panel, we can right click in here so you can see this the name for the panel. Somehow if you don't want the publish service in here, so you can uncheck this so you can hide from here. And if you want, you can open it like this if you need it. And in here we have expand all. This will expand all the panel on here. And you can also right click and select collapse then all so they can close all the panels in here. And one more feature in here, the solo mode, this is good. 
I click it, so that means in solo mode, I can click any of the panel, the other panels, they close like this. This will be good to do, like let me here. Same thing for this side, we can right click in here, this is the name for the panel that you want or you don't want get. So you can uncheck it like this for the command panel in here. And same thing in here, so you can use it in here. And in here on the space in here, right click and you have the option in here. You can add a small flourish like this. This is the one in here that can be nice on here so you can put it. Or if you don't want, you can check none in here. So this is the way we can do for the panel in here.